Wow, look at that. Oh my God. It is so moist. Look at that. The mushroom, the black truffle, the Swiss is just falling right off. If you gave this to somebody and told them it's black pepper, Swiss cheese, and mushrooms, they would totally believe you. Today I'm here at a Burger King location in Bangkok, Thailand to try some unique items from the menu. And these items are very, very different and unique from any other Burger King I've ever been to. So if you've seen the last video where I tried unique items from the McDonald's, this is going to be the same kind of style, but there's less food because the price was a little bit higher. And I'm not rich. I'm not making money off YouTube. This is just a hobby. So before I try these items, I want to show you what I got. So first off, we have a burger. It was a burger meal. This is a black truffle mushroom Swiss burger. I've had mushroom Swiss from different places, but never black truffle. We have fries, standard fries that came with it. It will be interesting to see how these fries compare and stack up against the fries at McDonald's. We have a Coke Zero to stay healthier, of course. We have our sweet chili sauce, our ketchup sauce, same sauces that are offered at McDonald's. The grand finale here is the black truffle mushroom fries. Those look pretty phenomenal. So they have many different menu items here at Burger King. I could try different burgers, they have bacon burgers, they have everything. The point of this video is just to try black truffle stuff. I've never had black truffle in my life and it seems interesting. Maybe it's really not that good, maybe it is good. We're gonna find out now, so let's get into this food. Here we have the black truffle mushroom Swiss burger. Let's take a look at it here. Look at that. Wow. Look at all the Swiss cheese, the black truffle. Black truffle looks like pepper to me, but... Wow, look at that. Oh my God. It is so moist. This bun is really, really moist. It's a little bit soggy feeling. It is a single patty only. Let's see if we can take a look at that patty. There's that patty there. Wow, it's so soggy. It doesn't weigh that much. Let's try this out, Let's see how good it is, because it's getting more soggy by the minute. Mmm. Wow. Mushrooms are really, really tender, if that's the word for mushrooms. Really slimy. The cheese is pretty good too. They actually melted the cheese a significant amount, like they're supposed to. Sometimes when you go to McDonald's or Burger King, the cheese isn't even melted, but you can really taste that black truffle. Mm. It's perfect, like, the burger is a little bit dry, but having the mushroom, having the Swiss on top actually makes it a little bit moist. Look at that, the mushroom, the black truffle, the Swiss is just falling right off. Honestly, I never knew what black truffle tasted like, but it's pretty good, and it goes really well with the mushroom and the Swiss cheese here. They do have this burger in a double patty size, but I wasn't looking to pay extra or really eat too much of a, a burger. Burger King is definitely good, I like it. Also, Burger King has really good buns with the seeds on top, but that patty is definitely very, very thin. Just really, really slimy. First up, we have the regular fries. Let's try these before we get into the truffle fries. A little bit of sweet chili on there. Oh wow, this chili has a, has a kick to it. More of a kick than the McDonald's chili did. This chili is definitely way better. These fries are super salty, super crispy, and everything. Burger King fries are not as good as McDonald's fries, no way. I loaded it up on the ketchup. Let's try it with the ketchup too. Mm. Tastes like American ketchup. Next up are these black truffle fries here. As you can see, it's just regular fries, the mushrooms, the Swiss cheese, and the black truffle on it, just like the burger. Wow, look at that. They're steaming. All right, let's try these. Mm. The mushroom is powerful. The moisture of the mushroom, the cheese has actually seeped into the french fries, so the french fries are a little bit soggy on the underside, but above they're still crispy. We have some cheese, we have some mushrooms, we have some fries, right? And some black truffle. Mm. Pretty good. Now, I don't know if these are better than just regular cheese fries, but cheese fries are always a good way to go. Adding some mushroom to it is interesting. These fries have just melted all together. It's a big cluster. Really different from the regular fries because they are soft and they're like a little bit soggy. 
but that truffle is really powerful. More powerful than black pepper, even though it appears to be black pepper. If you gave this to somebody and told them it's black pepper, Swiss cheese, and mushrooms, they would totally believe you. I mean, I would. These are really, really salty though. A little bit more saltier than my liking, but definitely approve of them. I definitely recommend black truffle fries. All right, just finished up that meal there. It was pretty good. Now I want to tell you about the pricing and what I thought of each item specifically. Got the receipt here, and yeah, the bill came to a little bit higher than I thought it was going to come to. It was a total of 408 baht. That's for everything. That's for the burger meal plus the truffle fries. So individually, the truffle fries cost 139 baht. 139 baht comes to four dollars and fifteen cents. So four dollars and fifteen cents for those fries. It's probably a decent price. Maybe it's a little bit expensive. And then the burger with the Coke with the other fry costs a total of 269 baht. 269 baht is eight dollars and four cents. Eight dollars and four cents for the burger, the fries, and the Coke. Now that's definitely more expensive than it should be, and it's equivalent to the price that's probably in the United States, I think. Interesting enough, when I looked at the menu, the burger without the meal was about 300 baht. But with the meal, it came to 269 baht. So I think they gave me a discount, which is a good thing. But still, the price of it is actually a little bit expensive and a little bit steep. But you're paying for that black truffle, of course. So overall, the price, maybe not the best, but the individual items we had, the fries were really good. Not as good as McDonald's. McDonald's fries are always the top fries anywhere I think uh, unless you have steak fries steak fries are really good actually the coca-cola same as normal right the black truffle burger with the Swiss and mushroom that was actually pretty damn good and it was worth a try I think now would I order it again mm, probably not because it's a little bit expensive and a little bit more than I want to pay now the black truffle cheese fries with the mushrooms those were actually really good as well. If you do order black truffle cheese fries, you need to eat them kind of immediately, right when they come out when they're hot. Otherwise, they begin to get too soggy, and then it's not as good. And they definitely over-salted them, so I have enough sodium in me to last the rest of the week. I probably will start bloating in about 30 minutes. And the sweet chili sauce actually was really good. Better than the sweet chili sauce that is at McDonald's. And maybe it shouldn't be considered sweet because there's a little bit kick in it. I don't know, but it's good. I approve. So there you have it. That's me trying the black truffle here at Burger King in Bangkok, Thailand. Now, if you come here, try black truffle. Let me know what you think of it. But that's it. I don't want to spend any more money here. I'm out of here.